Good. Good. So, uh, looking at the account, what's your goal at the game? Um, really just to understand the game and just get better, man. I mean, I don't really have like a rank goal, I guess. I think I'm like bronze. What brings but, you to this uh, game? Uh, well, I'm an RTS player, so StarCraft, Warcraft, all that good stuff. I, That's my I used to play that. Gig. How old are you? Uh, 30. Oh, cool. Yeah, I used to play. I mean, a big reason why uh, I attribute a lot of my uh, my ability to learn this game quick was through RTS. So, but it's no big deal. Like it, this, this isn't Korea, dude. You guys don't need to be doing level one stupid shit. <laughs> you understand? Like, just just chill. Now, at the start, it depends on what your support does. If your support pushes, you guys can try to look for some damage. Remember that you could try to space her with rockets as well. Like, you could rocket a minion next to her. Yeah, that's the type of move I would try to mix in. Since we're pushing, I'm very likely going to try to find random autos. Since the, uh... There you go. Looks like they're pushing into us, actually. So, we could just sit back. Now you're on defense, right? And what's going to happen is you're going to keep your health a lot higher doing this. Now, <clears throat> you ask yourself, well, what am I allowed to go in? When the wave trims out or if they overplay in a wave somehow, maybe. But otherwise, you treat it like it's very dangerous. Like that, that's an overplay. You see? That's an overplay. Now back up, though. Good. Now run back to tower and play defense. You see what I mean? That was an overplay. On her part, yeah, yeah. Right. She went way deep for no my, fucking my reason. Let, push. let it come under. Yeah. Just like before. Let it come under. Think about the, each individual farm. Just. Wow. You're okay. You're, it's just tough. It's a luck. She's got good range. I look so better already. See the difference? Yeah. Now, I would just I go. Yeah, yeah. If he sets it up. If he sets it up. All right. I just push to get a recall now. Now we're low, so let's try to push. Careful, don't don't stand too close. She's gonna bind you. I would just back up and recall. You're behind tower. Yep. We can't push out, it's too dangerous. Now, what I would do is I would go double longsword and boots. Uh yeah, boots. Sweet. Heal up to full. And let's get back out there. Oh, he lost that. Damn. Oh, no. He's okay. Okay. Funny game. You see some dude flying over the wall with a fucking beach umbrella, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Goofy fucking game. Now, we lost some farm here because they jammed the wave, but they haven't based yet. So that means if they stay and you land a W, you yeah, could probably right. walk it in. Yeah, you could probably... Get something done. All right, I'd walk it in at them. I'd, I'd fight them. They have not backed yet. Oh, boy. It's all right. Try to land your W. Okay, walk up and try to land some rockets. Yeah, that the movement's cool. Like, wiggling around is cool. All right, just hard, just hard shove the wave. Now, you're on offense, so they're really low. So what I would do is I'd shove the wave and try not to use rockets because you want to keep your mana high. Get the wave under and bomb them with W's and pressure them a bit since they're low now. Try not to get binded, but, you know, fling some W's at her. Okay, auto the tower a bit. Yep. You're okay. Auto the tower a bit. You got time. She has very little mana. Now push this wave. Yep. Now they're Supposed pinging something, so you should be things. moving your camera. Yeah. I keep shoving. Keep shoving, though. You can't get over there, but you can definitely shove the wave under. And you should swap to minigun, too, to keep your mana up higher. Now move your camera over. You've got a W option. Nice. Now just back up. Now can you rotate over? All right. Cool. Now there, I would just take a... I would clear the ward, and I would just take a recall. Yeah, press B. Yeah, press B. So you got to push that wave all the way to tower. And you can get Noon Quiver here. Yep. Actually, undo and get the boots. Sorry. Undo and get the uh, tier 2 boots. Like, right press the undo right. button. No, just press the undo button on the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's go. 
Now, the reason we back there, just like I showed you in the thing, the wave is under tower. She can't get it all the way to your yep. tower in time, right? So you get <sighs> a back time. Yeah, yeah. Yep. So as soon us. as the play was dead, it's just like, all right, I can just recall here and snag the wave with boots. I just received the wave calmly. Now remember, your job is to hit farm right now. This shit that you're doing is crazy. You're missing farm everywhere, and you're panicking because Sorry. he's panicking. Remember the rules yeah, of the game. Freaked out. freaked me out. Yeah, just focus on your farm. You have Ws you can use, and you're standing in melee range of minions right now. This is not what we taught. You're worrying way too much about dumb shit. I'm telling you right now, you do not have to worry about that right now. You can maybe look up to W, but that's about it, okay? You can W, just keep the wave there. Now, if he's, you have a rock, you, you have an ult. Yeah, you can ult that. Okay, oh, she healed. I just kite back. Yep, just kite back. I W that shit. Oh, oh, is she oh, dies to a minion? Ah, oh. uh, you could flash auto with cannon if you could get around it. Uh -oh. Oh, 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 oh. Now you see what's killing you here. Sorry. Look at where Heimerdinger is. Look where the wave is. Look where you're standing. You're standing way too close. There's no reason for you to be there. The most you could do is you could give him. You can maybe slide to the top and try to sneak a W in, maybe. But that's not yeah, even good. That's here. just just farm. Now let it play out. Watch what you do. Press P. Watch. You're so distracted by it. You're just freaking out. Look at you. Freaking out. <laughs> just farm. Like, it doesn't matter. Like, you're just getting so tunneled on it. You want to help everybody so bad. Just, you're dropping farm everywhere, and you can't do anything. Yeah. This the, whole thing. I, I you, felt like now I you, can walk, like you can walk up. Like, you can step felt, over the wave. Warwick. But you could step over the yeah. wave and maybe W. See you know what I mean? Yeah, I feel like I should have I should have been up here helping with W rather than sitting back here in this instance. Yes, yeah. but you're still getting the farm. Listen, the key, go ahead and press P. The key that I want you to realize is that the farm is the hierarchy. You can farm while like looking forward and be like, ooh, can I squeak a W in there maybe or something? But like you're not oh. going past your farm like a fucking five-year-old that just saw like cookie or something dude like you're gonna sit there yeah. on the wave yeah. and properly farm and then if it's if it behooves you to help you're gonna help but the key is you can't just like skip over the wave die or some dumb shit and then lose all that farm that's just illegal yeah so you're saying the farms here they're effing around doing whatever they're doing just be be here throw some w's still get my farm yeah you might be able to sneak an auto right in kill, maybe but in. It, yeah. but in yeah. your brain listen what happens is when you're new your brain's like oh shit i gotta help dude stop that right away the yeah. waves dictate the action the wave doesn't make sense and your teammates are freaking out that means they don't know how waves work right so if the wave is like on our tower we don't skip over 20 minions to chase you're gonna see that a lot when you're new don't do it because you'd be just like them Tough, you, you, yeah. you're taking a bunch of damage because you're you're worried too much about what your teammates are doing focus yeah, I, on the wave you dead look at what we're missing right now you could have gotten all this farm for free you could have had your health high yeah. the entire time but you kept stepping yeah. into the wave because your teammates Remember what I showed you? It, the rules apply to yeah. everyone. Your teammate skipping over the wave like that, that means that he doesn't know how the game works. And that's okay. Right? That doesn't... That's not a big deal. You just don't do dumb shit with them. Yeah. Right? I just... I felt like I was going to get trolled. It doesn't matter. It doesn't... No, that. it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Let's see, though. My house is this or going on the wave? You can W it. You can W it. You want to try to keep it, like, short and sweet. Yeah, now right back to lane. Yeah. Because you see that whole time, we're, we're all missing gold down here, right? God damn it. I now, I would absolutely for... hard push, yeah, because no one's in wave. And slow pushing doesn't seem to accomplish much. It's going to be really hard for you to kill people on your own. 
should probably now run away. Yeah, throw your W, throw your E. This would be a lot easier if you would use W or E, like a lot easier. <laughs> to get behind the tower and recall. We don't want to stay with this low health. This is pointless. That's why you shoved. Like, what exactly are you going to do with 15% HP as Jinx? When you're running away like that, um, and you see someone flash on you, like the Misfortune flashed at you, try to just W or E as a response. Oh, you might get lucky. I don't think it kills him, though, because he's tanky. Right, I think if he backed up, maybe. Oh, he, he went forward. He went to the next tower. Remember what the goal of today is, because you keep abandoning the goal, okay? Yeah, yeah, sorry. Okay. Receive the wave. Calmly hit the farm, just like we... Uh, yeah. Don't just walk into melee range, just like I showed you on the drill. There you go. Because it's 2v1, right? Uh-oh. You got to move more yeah, to the top of it. It was in the way. That was really bad. Yep, it'll come with practice. Try to use minigun here. Your, your splash damage is fucking everything up. See, now you're going to have to auto twice. You got W as well. Oh, God. That was a troll flash. Am I just backing, I assume? Yeah, move your camera forward, though, as you back. You might have an ult now. See, you can see your defense needs a lot of work. You could actually W that oh. from range. Coming to alt and W? Or? Nah, nah. You could W it and run away, though. I just cannon it now. And then run away. I get in the bush and recall. Yeah, the panic mob kicks in when the uh, wave's under tower. That's for sure. I need to work on that. You just got to chill and just every minion one at a time. Like I said, try to try to focus on one minion at a time and nothing else. <clears throat> so I'm freezing. I'm, I'm, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's I'm the same now. We're just going to wait. I mean, unless, you know, your teammates push out with you and you know that you've got a wave. But otherwise, yeah, I, I would just... But, like, there, look at the wave. Line, right? Yeah, just look at the wave. Who cares what he's doing? If he push... Now I ping him off. I want the wave to come to us. I don't want to push it out. I don't just sit in it. Just practice just like we just like we did the, the drill. Why are you sitting on it? You're not learning yeah. anything doing that. Put a ward above you. Remember what happened last time. Yeah. That's better. I like that you're trying to walk out of range between. That's a better habit to build. Minigun's preferred here because you don't want to push the wave out. Now, usually it's about like four or five minions to hold a freeze. So as long as you're keeping that the ratio, it should be fine. Like four or more, more or four or more than what you have there. Pull back. That's that means that they're gonna be showing up soon, just so you know. Now she's shoving that wave in. So what you can do is you can in response, you can rocket the wave to slow it down. Like you can occasionally dump some rockets. Yep. Kite back. And then get behind your menu so you don't tank them, and then just work on freezing it again. Get rid of the cannon so it's easier to manage, because right now that cannon's gonna fuck everything up. There you go. See how it's going to be a lot easier to manage this now. Now, yes, as you're doing this, that's how you can get better at the game too, is, is you can move that camera around. That's good. That's, that's very good that you're doing that. That means you clearly played RTS games, if you can do that. <laughs> and like juggle your, your uh, camera. That's a fat man. Right he there. needs to be very low to ult him. He needs to be very low and you need to know where he's basing because that guy's hard to kill. I would wait. He has to be very low. He's dead anyways. That's the good ult. 
Get him. Get him. Uh, oh, push. Hard push. Hard push. Hard push. Into that? No, no, no. Hard, hard push. push. Okay. Yeah, because no one's okay. in your lane. Yeah, no one's in your way. Think about yeah, it, right? It's just, yeah. it's just a math yeah. problem. That's all it is. Now you push because they, they left the wave. They're not drinking from the faucet, remember? So it's like now you could just push this to tower. And now what you're doing is you're creating a situation where since they're not here, look at this farm that Misfortune is going to lose if she doesn't run down here at Mach 10. Right? Now you can hit the tower a little bit because they have to leave base because there was four dead. You could probably take the tower. Actually, no, leave, 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 leave. I'm dumb. I, you shouldn't take the tower. Because you want that, you want the tower to kill the minions. Take a recall. I'm backing, yeah. Yeah. See, now look at the minions just so you can learn from this. Look at the... She's losing all this and then some. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you I held the tower up. She'll lose more here. Yeah, Right. You could still okay. take it later, but like... If this is a smarter way... Now go and grab a blue trinket. You're level 9. Now look, just like that's before, the, yeah, this thing? yep, that's a blue trinket. Yeah, that's what it used to be called, I guess. Now move to mid, and then look out for an ult, realizing that that timing is closing. So since they pushed, I would just go to bottom. So just go to bottom. Since there was two bottom, it pushed fast. Okay. You can fling it if you want. Always. That's good. You helped. Might might that's get the kill helps. off of it. Yeah. There it is. Now I would start loosening up a little bit. Uh, actually, never mind. There's two here. Careful. There's two here. Let let Warwick lead. You can't get bursted. Oh boy. Yeah, that's why. You, yeah, just run, 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 run. Back to defense. Back to defense. Back to defense. You got heal. You got heal. Okay. Use your W to farm that, and then run away because Lux is coming around the backside. Run away. Run away. She's coming. Let, now right. look at Malzahar. Look at Malzahar. You fling your W at this guy. You you outrange him with W, so it's fine. All right, go back to tower and focus on farming. Let your teammates do that. You don't have to go for fancy outplays. Just let was, just focus here, on farming. I was flashing that hard. Yeah, you don't need to do all that, though. Just hit farm, don't die, remember? Yep, yep. Uh, we the kills will nice. come. They will come automatically. Throw your blue trinket in the tri bush above you. Just fling it up there. It goes from range. Oh, shit, I don't have to go up there? That's sweet. Yeah, that's why it's a, it's a late game warding item for ADCs. You should hard push here um, because two are dead. Yep. Right? It's a little risky. Like, Silas can come for you, but you want to get as much farm as you can before backing. Remember, mix in the W as well. Jesus. Hard push quick, quick, quick. You should be autoing this whole time. Again, this bush, duck into the alcove probably and then take a recall. Now, just like that, from a deficit, you've got your item, right? And now you're building towards Phantom Dancer. All right, so let's... Uh, you've got an ult option, maybe top. Nope. He's not low enough. But you can go to mid, because, yep, you have a timing now. Then no one's pushing yep. the wave, see? Lux is I thinking about it. But that's not going to be... No. You wouldn't go to mid yet. Um, Lux is pushing bot, so you have a little bit longer. But you can go mid and maybe help for a push. About two seconds from playing. All right, let's yeah, let's let's hit tower here in mid and look for an ult top. Okay, they're pretty healthy, so I would just focus on tower. Lux is below you. Can you pinch Lux below you? You can fight her. Below you, below you, below you, below you, below you, below you, below you. Oh, God damn it! God damn it! W or W or you outrange her. Oh, I'm not gonna get hit by the tower anymore. No, you're good. Now you need to just try to shove this out so you can get a recall. Shove quickly. Now go to your bot side. Go to your bot side and get farm. You don't want to do all this fancy shit. Just if you want to siege, can't get you can't get this low. Cool to walk through this river like an yeah, idiot. Yeah, yeah. Well, there was four top and Lux was mid, right? That's what you should be doing. It's just a math problem. Use that plant. Use that plant. Now push this all the way up to tower as fast as you can. Yep. Rockets, rockets. Remember that you have W that you can mix in as well. Cool. Oh, that sucks. Keep pushing. Just focus on the push first, and then you can look for an ult.
in the bush. Oh, you can maybe yeah. rotate it. But the thing is, is like it's an awkward rotation because you're low, right? Now you should be looking at the map and ask yourself, where am I? Okay, there's. All right, you know where everybody is. Push bot. You know where everybody is. You just saw two top and you just saw two mid and one's dead, right? I get her. Let's go. So now you push this all the way up because you know that two were top, right? So you can push this wave and I would put a blue trinket between where their base is and where they could come from. So like maybe in the jungle. Right yeah, yeah, yeah. Here. Yeah, that's cool. Either's cool. Now push quick. Now run away before Jarvan goes on you. Run away, run away, run away, run away, run away. You could W him, but, but like you're just bailing. Yeah, I do. Let's see that guy. My game awareness is so bad. It's all right. All right it'll come. I think a recall. Yeah. But you see, you've pushed up. You you navigated the, the fact that they were, you know, two top, two mid or whatever. And you got some extra gold. Now you can build a zeal and build a longsword. And then you've got your blue trinket. So you can get a pink if you want. Pink ward. Uh, it's a control ward. Yeah. All right, let's get out there. Now, again, you have a timing where you can go to mid and chill. You might have to pick up bot wave later. But, you know, you've got an item and a half. So you can run to mid. You can even ping your mid laner to go and catch bots if you want to do some more DPSing, right? Um, I'm the type of person, I just hit big farm because I know eventually is Jinx, I'm going to just win. Here you can walk up and auto him. He's low, right? Like, you can absolutely walk up and try to find a W, pressure him. Like, walk up confident. Okay. If you see him, W him. Okay, I thought he had that. Walk, rotate to your team. Rotate to your team. Now you have an item. Now you're stronger, right? So let's walk over. Maybe ult that guy. Yeah, cool. Let's ro rotate the top and try to land some Ws. Land some Ws. Kite back, though. Let your teammates lead. Yeah. There you go. Kite back. You've got your flash. you got your E as well. you got your E. E should be the first thing that comes down. Remember, you get gap close on. Yeah. Now you can go kill the Slug. She's on your left. Yeah. You're just going to try to land a W on her while pushing the wave. You're going to push the wave. If you notice, I prioritize waves more than kills. I don't really care about kills. Kills just fall in your lap when you're good. You understand? Yep, you can get that free kill now. Cool. Now run to the wave and shove it and then take a recall. Am I helping with this? Baron yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to you gotta get this wave under though. So they're losing money. Right now, right now you can rotate. Now take your recall. Yeah, take your recall. It's not, though. You never know. They could come and contest it or something. A Phantom Dancer. Sweet. Now get on the map. Now the first thing you do is you think, what's the closest resource right now I can get? I'd be looking at bot lane. I'd take that portal right above you because there's a portal now because of the dragon that they got. And then drop to bot lane. Maybe shove like... Maybe shove a wave or two and then group up on mid. Push this all the way up. I'd push one more, actually. One more wave. Move. Yeah, that's good. That you're moving your camera. That's good. Shove this wave and then group. Like, you're basically pushing with the intent to go behind your team in DPS. Fight's looking shittier because your team's not in position to help. Get your camera over there. And we're deciding whether or not we want to rotate. Rotate through river. Don't rotate through jungle. Actually, rotate around safer than that. Rotate wider. To your, yeah, see, that's why. W. W. Yeah, that's good. W and back up. And auto. Just auto. Auto it. Okay. Now, think about Silas. He's a little bullshit. If you sidestep that fucking E, that when he dashes, like, or I'm sorry, the, the chains that he throws, if you sidestep yeah. that, when you W first, to him. slow okay. him, sidestep the, the E, and then you just DPS him down, you win. Okay. So W, oh, was basically what I'm getting is every time I see somebody... Every time somebody's range, aggressing you... From range, W first. W. If they gap yeah. close successfully, E and then space. Yeah. Right, but you and, and the W is how shit. the W is how you can get you can just start spacing them right away. Because if you hit a slow, your range is so high that you could just start autoing them, and it's really hard for them to respond. Because if they don't close the gap quick, you just shred them anyways. So I would collect bot. Yeah. All right, never mind. Malzar has it. He has it. So you just go mid.
I take chickens or something? Yeah, he can. He can snag. Now I would be running down mid first. I would skip chickens here because of the fight. Yeah, I would. I would push up because they, you know, because they're winning the fight and they got two kills. So you want to get towers. That I already used my R. Yeah, I would just take tower and then drop in on the Gragas maybe. So yeah, kind of take tower and sprint over and see if you can W him maybe. Just a quick peek. Uh, you might have been able to sneak in there and cannon auto um, because he was slowed. If you land that W, don't be afraid to try to find an auto. Just as a rule of thumb. Yeah. Especially with four dead, no one was going to challenge you. I would kite back with W. Yeah. Remember that defense training. Yeah. Kite back. Kite back first. Kite back and assess first. Kite back and assess. You've got your W. Your W is your poke. Kite back and just assess it. Try to assess it. There you go. Now you can auto. Now you can maybe get some... Mm, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I got one with the ult. That was good. Yeah. Fling your W out as well. Yeah, just swing around river. Safe, safe, safe. Go go the safe way. Always go the safe way. Keep moving the camera. Yeah. Just go to like Heimerdinger and then fling some W's. But you've got to be more willing to W people. Like just fling that shit. Like right there. Fling it. Yep, good. Now you need to march in with Heimerdinger or, or Fiora either. It doesn't matter. Just get with somebody so you can land autos. And get kind of position behind him and then fling your W. Good. Now auto. Now you get to auto. He just gap closed. Auto the fuck out of that guy. Use uh, miniguns when they're that close. Uh, That's three dead. I think you guys could end. <clears throat> I think. Is this making sense though? No, it definitely is. I just need to practice a lot. Uh, it yeah, makes look sense for that ult. Look for sure. that ult. Yeah, fuck that guy up. Uh, fuck Fucking yeah. Gragas. We can go to mid. We can go to mid and push. So you're splitting farm. Because right now you're splitting it four ways. See, you could have walked over there and got that for yourself. Without splitting it. Now they're splitting it with you again. See? Auto the tower. You have free autos here. Don't be afraid. There's three dead, right? Remember, W and try to land autos. W and kite back and land autos. Yep. There you go. Throw your E down. W. Remember to space. Remember to space. Yeah. That's good. Yeah, keep trying to find autos. Find some autos. They just used a bunch of shit. There you go. Land a W. Find autos. Let's try. If you idea. flash shield, you could have killed them both. Oh, shoot. I forgot I had summoners. <laughs> Oh, Look, no. they're pinging him for you to let you know in case you forgot it. Yeah, I see, I see that. <laughs> I deserve that. Sell the Doran's Blade and sell the... Uh, the or the, yeah, sell the Doran's Blade too. Get the pickaxe. That's funny. Just in case you forgot. I love the toxic community of League. It's actually it's, it's incredible. It's incredible. It's... It, it's... Uh, it's going to be really funny when you outrank these people that have been playing for 10 years in like, you know, in a year. There's some hard stuck, uh, hard stuck rounds players. Yeah. They, um, th they think they know everything. They, uh, they never learn anything that they pretend that they know. Right. It's very, it's very unique. Let's go to Baron. Let's go to Baron. Uh, can we land W on anybody? E? E? Yeah. Auto, auto, and kite back. You have flash, you have heal as well. Sweet. Let's try. Cool. Sweet. Now you just Baron. Uh, I don't think we can solo it. Yeah. Yeah. It's okay. They end. It's fine. GG's. What did we learn today? What's 
sorry, man. Um, yeah, honestly, biggest thing, probably defense and not walking after people stupidly. The, um, the keys here is about whether or not you can get your farm reliably, like I said, and space. Remember the, the layering. The process is very simple. If people are posturing at you aggressively, fling your W on them. If they successfully gap close, put your E down, right? And then immediately move to position defensively, like max range, and then auto. Yeah. Now, you're very shy right. to auto, even as the game progressed. That'll come with time. But, like, yes, you should be working on spacing first. 